There's been some discussion on the community forum about whether or not it's ever a good idea to let the AP's spouse or significant other know about the affair. I know there's a lot of things to consider when making a decision like this. I certainly wish someone would have told me sooner instead of finding out when I did. Isn't it God's will that sin is exposed and in the light and not hidden? I appreciate your thoughts. I don't have a simple answer to your question. I agree it's very complicated and when you think when I think about some of my thoughts obviously if they're good friends, if they're people you know and it's involved in your social circle, that is one circumstance where I think a lot of times it makes a lot of sense. Um, especially if it's there's a really good likelihood things are going to be discovered anyway. At the same time, if I had a friend who was having an affair and I was good close personal friends with, you know, their mate, my approach would be to confront the person having the affair and say, hey, you know, you need to let your mate in on what's happening. Um, if I were in um, a position of authority, certainly I would do that. Uh, but forcing someone to, or telling someone when they may not even want to know, uh, can also lead to some pretty disastrous things. I've seen that go very badly. I've seen people commit suicides. If it's not somebody you already are close to or you know something like that, um, generally in my opinion, um, it'll play out over time. And I don't know that you can know what's good or bad. Uh, if you feel a need to confront the affair partner, that's one thing. But it's too easy in anger, I think, to do that without really considering the long-term ramifications. Um, so you can hear me talk around this topic for hours. To me it's kind of on a case-by-case -case basis. Generally I leave that one up to God. If they need to know they'll find out. Um, a lot of times, like I said, I'll encourage someone to go to their mate and talk to them. Um, maybe if you really stop, pray about it, think about it, you can kind of come up with an answer, but you've got to really ask why do I really want them to know? Is part of it because I want the other person to experience what I'm experiencing? 